over here to probably end of the year. You guys will have them out. Yeah, late 2022. Um, you know, one of the things that, well, we're excited about it. We debuted it at SEMA um, in 2021. It's being produced in Eastern Europe. And Obviously know, problems there. Know, yeah. Right? So uh, that's constrained a lot of the development as well as um, But outside of when it's going to be, the, the significant parts about this is that most people associate miles or tires with value, right? Yeah. This could be better best, it's going to be at that good price level. This is going to compete with every other AT on the market. And it's either going to... Let's just say there's no AT that's going to beat what it has. 19 30 seconds tread depth. And that's on every size, every correct? Size, every size. 19 30 seconds tread depth. We've got um, 3 PMS snowflake rating on right. every size. Um, there's a two ply sidewall, right? That's okay. Pretty standard for everybody. Uh, however, it's got a 55,000 mile warrant. Cool. Which again is oh, no. leading <laughs> in the category for what it is. No yeah. Tread depth. Plus it has this aggressive yep. um, that everybody seems to Yeah, no, I, I love the look of it. It's obviously a little bit better than the, the ATR that you guys had for, yeah, for so many years. Um, you know, but there's a market for that too, you know. Um, but so many, so much of the taste is being put towards if people want the capability or they want the aesthetic. Or yeah. The yep. So this is our answer to that. Nice. And. Are you guys going to be offering anything kind of like more CUV sizes? I know the 15 inches will so, be available. So we do have we do have some of uh, some of our products. Um, right now we only have our ATR in like I think a 245, 65. Yeah, which 16 or 17 is a really if, so it's like a 29 and a half yeah, kind of right. That's right? our smallest one today, right? Yeah. Our friends over at Reiko Wheels have a um, a Rav4 with that equipment, but. This will have a smaller, I think our, our smallest is like a 27 or a 27 and a half. Okay. And I forget the specific size, but we know that the diameter and the width are a it's, significant. There's always so much variables anyways, but right. yeah, it's, yeah. The, the diameter, outer diameter itself obviously is. The nice thing is, is that a lot of wheel companies are adapting to fitments and going to see if you specific. Yeah. And you know, you need at least one or two sizes to be able to go there and tailor to that. Yeah. Um, so that's really what we're targeting. This is a broad line of um, sizes. I think we've got over 50 sizes. Wow. Um, are, are all of them going to be available at launch or is it going to kind of be staggered? That's hard to say. We had we had 20, we had 20 sizes in the Belgium in over 20 sizes in the Belgium over 3 or 4 weeks ago. Okay. Um, that would be halted because of world events. Yeah. Um, so I can't say what we're going to have. Okay. At rollout. We will have a majority, but a specific quantity, I don't know. Yeah. That, but obviously hard, hard to say with with sure. like we said world world yeah. issues. Um cool. Uh thanks so much for your time on that. Yeah. I really appreciate it. Have a good day. Yeah, you too.